let us now proceed with the next topic, programming languages. Language is the medium of communication, so in order for two parties to understand each other, there should be a common language. The English language, being the universal language, may be used by humans to communicate. But for a human to communicate with a machine, or take for example a computer, a programming language must be utilized. The programming language is divided into two levels. First is the low-level language. These are categorized into machine language or assembly language. And we have the high-level language. The only language that a computer understands is the machine language, which is referred to as machine code. It generally consists of strings of binary numbers such as zeros and ones. This gives instructions to computers to perform its most elementary operation one at a time. A machine code can be directly executed by a computer. Machine language programming was simply too slow, tedious, and error-prone for most programmers since a programmer does not really use the machine language as its language. As a result, instead of using the strings of binary numbers that computers could directly understand, programmers began using English-like abbreviations to represent elementary operations. These abbreviations form the basis of assembly languages. So translator programs called assemblers are required to convert assembly language to machine code or what we call the machine language. Computer usage increased rapidly with the advent of assembly languages, but programmers still had to use many instructions to, to accomplish even the simplest task. So to speed up the programming process, high-level languages were developed in which single statements could be written to accomplish substantial tasks. The high-level languages allow programmers to write instructions that look almost like everyday English and contain commonly used mathematical notations. High-level languages are preferable to machine and assembly language. The C, C++, Microsoft, Visual Basic, and Java are among the most widely used high-level programming languages. Translator programs called the compilers now convert the high-level language programs into machine language. So that sums up programming languages.